Now, the WGAL News 8 Storm Team forecast with meteorologist Brian Argenti. It's very nice tonight across the Susquehanna Valley right now. It's got some high level clouds that are passing over the valley, but overall it's going to be a very nice end to our evening as well as night for overnight tonight. I want to bring your attention to something really quick. See a little white speck right there, that big, that big uh, ball of light right there. That right there is Venus. We just had the moon set over the horizon a little bit ago, but I wanted to draw your attention. If you look west right now, you see that big bright star or really it's a planet. It's Venus that is uh, currently over the horizon. 47 degrees now in the capital with a 33 degree dew point. As we head into uh, to our almanac, it'll be 57. We hit a high of 57 degrees today. Lows last night we hit 35 degrees, so we're slightly below average for this time of year. 40 degrees, 59 degrees for our high High averages. So just when you thought we were going to be seasonable or stay seasonable, we're going to warm up as we go back into the middle of this upcoming week. But for this evening, 44 to 48 degrees, we'll have a few high clouds. It'll be refreshing as well, mostly clear, and it will stay mostly clear as we go into tonight as well. It will be chilly though. We'll drop down into the upper 30s, some spots into the lower 30s as well. But again, mostly clear, calm, gonna be a very nice night tonight. But for tomorrow, sun and clouds, it'll be comfy, milder, especially 62 to 66 degrees. We'll have a southeasterly breeze start to pick up. Now we do have a plan for you for election day. This is our forecast for uh, for Tuesday. So we'll start with 52 degrees, some clouds and sun. It'll be cooler, yeah, it'll be quite chilly actually. Partly sunny as well for the afternoon and warm, 76 degrees. Then we'll start to have a light breeze start to kick in. Still mild by the time the polls close right around 8 o'clock. 50 now in Lancaster, 47 in Harrisburg, 40 in York at this time. Storm Team Live Radar Network, all is quiet except for a couple of passing high level clouds as we put overlaid the satellite imagery for you. We why not the picture and the entire Commonwealth is enjoying this uh, the, the clear skies. But again, that's thanks to that high pressure that's now shifting off to the northeast. And as that high pressure starts to shift to the northeast, that's going to give us a flow of some moisture off the Atlantic and increase our cloud cover a little bit. That's why we'll have partly sunny conditions going into Monday as well as Monday evening. We did have a warm front that just swiped across the screen there. That's what's also going to pick up the cloud cover and now we'll be in a warmer air mass allowing our temperature temperatures to start to warm Tuesday uh, Tuesday afternoon through Wednesday as well as we get into uh, the middle of this week. We'll have partly sunny conditions. Now we do have a tropical disturbance in the Caribbean Sea at this time. It's, it's known as the potential tropical cyclone 18. It's cut off by the banner there, but it's known as potential tropical cyclone 18. Now we are expecting the circulation to uh, to turn a storm to, into a tropical storm, but then increase to a cat one hurricane or category one hurricane and reach the Gulf and weaken by the time we get into the middle or end of this week. We're coming up on the next 10 days. We're 76 Wednesday. Then we go pleasant by the end of this week. Much more seasonable to start this upcoming weekend.